Let's see if this works. Hmm. So it's a mystery. A huge mystery. That stream is here. All right. Well, I just kind of rambled at the end of the other half because, oh good, so that worked. So maybe we should have done that the whole time. I gave, I, I, I rambled at, at, at YouTube if anybody actually watches that, but hi. Yes, sorry to YouTubers watching this archive. We are gonna go back to the game now. All right, here we are. Yes, there was some singing. There was some cat. All right, so where were we? We were writing bad poetry with Charles Barkley and his friend, the Vince Borg. Vince Bot? Vince Bot? You guys ready for this? All right. Oh no. Baltheos, no. I like that, um, I like that, um, that they said just do it. I was like, wait, I know what that is. Well, good, singing and cats are like the thing that I can provide to see how cute they are. You guys missed it, but YouTube gets to see that at the end of the previous thing, right before I had to shut down and then start up again, Ella's foot twitched in her sleep because she was having kitty dreams. <laughs> All right. Barkley. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh jeez. <laughs> Oh jeez. All right, we're doing this. We're just gonna go in. <laughs> Balthius, you invited this. You're the one who asked Barkley to participate. You had to know he wasn't going to play along properly. Okay, this is a good choice. This is a great choice. This is definitely the right choice. <laughs> Baldios, what did you expect, my friend? Huh. Not as funny as this. Alright, guys, are you ready? We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. Are you, are you ready to see how romantic uh, Vince Borg is? We are the best. Oh, she walked away. Hi! I like how there's like an exclamation point after literally everything she says. <laughs> it's from the snail. <laughs> oh my god, Barkley. You're not good at this, but okay. Oh dear. Thank you, Vince. This is gonna go really poorly, isn't it? Maybe it's gonna go well. Oh 
Okay, well. Good job, Vince. Vince knew what she liked. Okay then. That was very dramatic. Barkley! Balthios is, is, is floating back up to favorite character territory. Barkley! Barkley. What on earth did he drop? What is this? Oh. Power of stamp. Oh, it's a spell. Well, that's amazing. I'm... I'm glad to know. Oh, also an equipment? Oops. You. Whoa! It's really good! Oh man. We should go stay at the inn and be super obnoxious. Oh my god, I'm glad they let you skip past that. Yeah, Vince Borg is just... I love that he like says nothing. And then he's like, oh, I'm ready to help you write a poem. <laughs> and then he goes back to saying nothing after he finishes off his poetry. And I really love the way that like, it's like Vince's suggestion and Charles Barkley is just like, yeah, that, that's the line, use that line. And Bothius is just like... Let us stay in the end. Oh man, I thought we wait. Yeah, no Sims that does kind of feel like it. Alright, so I've got new gear. Probably should have explored the rest of town better. Or maybe I explored all of town. I feel like I did a pretty good job. God, the music is like occasionally annoying, but mostly really good. Should I? Okay. All right, so we're not supposed to stare at him. Something's not right. No. Is he gonna be like, is he gonna have like a basketball for a head? Or is his, like, stomach gonna be his face? Is his stomach and his face both gonna be basketballs? Like, is he all made of basketballs? Is he, like, gonna turn around and not have a face? Like with it's not quite looping is amazing. Hi, Knox. You are such a cutie girl. You are the cutest little cutie girl. Knox is so cute. Does he totally have a basketball for a face? He has a basketball for a face, doesn't he? He does! Oh my god, I was so right! I was so right! <laughs> I swear I have never seen this before. <laughs> I mean, they did warn me that there was going to be something about him not to stare. Please join my party. Basketball face. Got the music looping. This isn't... This isn't even writing tropes. This is just, you have to be in tune with their weirdness, I guess. And apparently I am. Barkley, are you gonna have something even meaner to say? Oh my God, he's from another dimension. Well, he's on the title screen. We're gonna have to check that out next time because I did not notice. <laughs> I was busy reading the quote and rocking out to the music. 
space. Oh, like Space Jam! I don't know. Sims, I don't know. If I will understand it in storytelling, ever. And then the music stops, and then it starts up again, like... No cyber dwarf skin, all they had bee balls. They were forced to graft bee balls to your skin! But... Um, okay, that I wouldn't have called. Oh no! Barkley's father! Oh my god. The drama just deepens with every passing moment. <sighs> oh no! No, no, no! No! <laughs> oh no, you think I'm my son! Oh no, Hoops is the chosen one. Oh no, Vince Borg is participating in a conversation. Thank you, Vince. Bad news. Is Bird going to betray us? I mean, he's clearly the chosen one, which is why this is like part one of the adventures of Hoops Barkley. Oh my god, are we going to go through this secret path into the church and rescue Princess Zelda? Because I'm down with that. Hello. Yes, yes, everybody. Oh my god, he's in my party. Is this a... Uh, is this a people player that I should know? So I don't know that name, but I don't know anyone's name. Okay, he's got to be a real person. Okay, tell me what I need to know about this guy, because I'm probably going to fight him. Like, no, but, no, but I mean, like, no, 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 no. <laughs> but, but 12 years ago, all of this stuff happened. 12 years, 12, 12 years, 12 years. Baltheos, are you from the future? Baltheos, are you from the future? I think you are. I think you're from the future, and that's why you're flipping out about stuff as though it's the distant past. It's not actually the distant past because it's 12 years ago. No, but we're 12 years in the future. I think Baltheos might be from the super future. The future future. Future squared. No, that's not working at all, Lauren. Oh man, I've been listening to so much cyberpunk music lately. No, but it's tw it's it's the future of no, but 
No, but the the cyberpocalypse happened 12 years ago when I chaos dunked things. Even though Barkley would be really old by the by 2040, and I just I, um. Okay. Um. <clears throat> Wait, no. The post cyber apocalypse? No, but I don't understand. Oh, that's not good. That looks exactly like a monster from Shining Force 2. Yes! A dread ref! Oh my god! A dread ref. That was amazing. Wait, Bill Murray was in Space Jam? I clearly we need to just watch Space Jam. Also, may may I draw your attention to my sleeping cat and how cute she is? I'm sorry that the camera's so washed up, but the lighting in my apartment is so bad. This is the only way that you can see my cats at all. Is Bill Murray going to show up in this game? Oh my god, that would be amazing. I would be so happy. Okay, let's see. You are going to hit the dread rough. Whoa, all the snails. The most of the snails. Bam! Okay, you're going to like just kill all these guys. Um, I assume this is actually a custom sprite, but it looks way too detailed to be theirs. I guess he does kind of look like a dwarf. With the mohawk, which I guess makes him a space- I mean, he's a space dwarf! Warhammer! Somebody tell me things that I might need to know about Warhammer space dwarves, right? I think we should have- we should use Rabbit or whatever it is to have a Space Jam movie night, because I haven't seen it in English. <laughs> I only saw it in French in high school French class. Um, so it wouldn't be on Twitch, but it would still be a thing we could do. We could arrange it through Discord or something like that. Alright. Pound enemies into oblivion with a combo. Oh my god. I think he is... Oh, rabbit would be appropriate, wouldn't it? Wow! So, rabbit is this thing that lets you watch a movie with your friends across distance. So, like, you play it and everybody else, like, logs in and you all watch the movie together and you can chat with, like, either voice chat or text chat. So, that's cool. Oh my god, Balthius! A lesser baller. Who is Scotty Pippen? Why is it an Alphad? Why is it in all that? Wait, Michael Jordan had a sidekick? Wait, 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 is Final Fantasy X actually canonical? Okay, so he was a sidekick, and that's why they talk about him being a lesser player here. Oh, so he was really good. They fought... Cr Wait. Somebody is fibbing. Oh, 
Oh, this dread wrath. Oh no. Guys! No, guys, that was Proto Man's whistle. Guys, that was Proto Man's whistle. And now the refs are Cuisinart blading my party. Jordan Pippen Mysteries. I'm, I'm, God, okay, I'm so confused. Hold on. Okay, so, so, sidekick. He was ridiculously good. So he wasn't a lesser player, but he was with this other guy who was more famous and they teamed up and that's why. I'm really confused. What is even going on with my party? Garbage disposal sounds are really unsettling. Hmm. Bam! Still not enough. Man, he is really good. I guess I don't get to know what the, uh... Yay! Look at my team! <laughs> Look at their excellent <laughs> animation! They're so well animated, and by so well animated, I mean not well animated at all, but that's okay. We're gonna use some protein paste. that phrase before. Is that a thing that this guy used to say? X caliber 20 something. Guys. They... it from behind and I did not succeed. It's time to slam jam. Welcome to the space jam. Roar. Oh no, I got fouled. Those guys are really nasty. I don't like them. Oh no, Vinsburg fouled and missed a turn. No, Krempty, I don't know anything. And it's okay, Scaploony, I don't know very much about any of these things. Papa Gable, I'm glad that I hope that you I hope that you listen to Flutie Bot and take better care of yourself because of it. Okay. Pound and these to Oblivion with a combo. Okay, I did that. That is the thing that I did. Whoop, whoop, whoop. The blender? Oh, 
Oh man, if it has a, if it has a train for Cyber Dorothy Suplex. Oh hey! Project Esper! We seem to have um, cast all of our characters. They're making final arrangements, so I can't tell you who the people are, but I can tell you I'm excited about it. I can tell you that the guy who, um, when I listened, they had us listen to the auditions to help them decide who was uh, gonna make the cut, and they had four people that they offered us for Locke, I think. And I listened to the first guy, and I was like, oh my god, it's Locke. And then the other three were just not Locke. And so I, like, in my comments, I was like, so this guy, this guy, this guy, excuse me, this guy, I will fight you. Anyway, he's cast as Locke. It was apparently an animus, but I would have fought them otherwise, so it worked out. If you guys don't know, I'm helping write a Final Fantasy VI musical, and we just cast the main characters. We may need to slam jam at a moment's notice. Let's just loop around. Oh. Okay, well, fine. I guess we don't get to do that. Maybe we'll do that after this. All right. Let us boss battle. That's right. Teresa, patron saint of slams and jams. Why is she Teresa again? Did you guys explain that to me last time? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Vince Borg. No, Scaplooni. This is, um, I didn't know there was a group that's, oh, do you mean the group that did a musical track for the Materia Collective Final Fantasy Tactics album? Because yes, some of those people are involved, but it is not just them. I think that was John Robert and Jeff Swingle. If it was, then yes, there are the guys spearheading it, but the writing team is different. We're working with them. It's a group of us. There's a total of two script writers and two lyric writers and two composers who are the ones that are running it. And that's the thing that we're doing. And I'm really excited about it. And they're like, yeah, Lauren, you get to like be the one who yells at us if things aren't appropriately fan friendly. I like the game. I don't know if the tactics thing is going to be a full-fledged thing. It's certainly not right now because they're doing Project Esper instead. But I think that that's where they got the idea that they wanted to do more. Anyway, B-Ball. Very serious. We're about to fight a B-Ball zombie? Question mark? And Vince Borg seems to be getting a memory back. Come on, Vince. Cyber Dwarf Vince is trying to have a memory. Uh oh, Barkley. Uh oh. He doesn't look that big. He looks just like every other person who's made of that sprite. They have to use the sprite. Oh, it's such a good song. Probably gonna die. I probably should have saved and healed and stuff. What do we got going on here? Palacious beam damage. That's pretty good. So, my dwarf is my cleric? White mage? White mage who punches dudes. So, yeah. No, a cleric. A cleric. Clerics can use blunt weapons, right? You can have a battle cleric. That's totally a D&D &D thing. Or I guess a cyber monk. I don't know. Okay. 
that's not going to work on this. This is the biggest spell I've got, so let's go for it. Oh my god, I'm shooting him with lightning bolts. Very dramatic. No! You just murdered my my cyborg buddy! Uh, I have a heal. Which one of these? Oh. Hey Paraguay! Is this gonna be a tearjerker game? To stifle foes. Is stifle a basketball word or is that just them using strange choices because they think they're funny? Oh, I guess he's dead already. That's a good song. Sorry, I have to do a victory dance. Oh, I got a femur. Oh my god, am I gonna give this bone to the dog? And the dog's gonna give me the best shoes ever? Oh my god, let's make the beeb all dimension. I just... God. So is he a nice dude? Was did he actually pray all the time? Or did they make that up? Oh my gosh, Barkley gets to apologize to everybody who got murdered because of him. This is probably good for giving him closure. The power of jams! The Forbidden Jam Holy Dunk! Uh oh, is this gonna be sassy? Yes! Barkley, I'm so glad for you. That looks like... Oops. Double team? Oh wow, I completely didn't do this entire section. Oh, hello. I clearly haven't used the skills enough because I don't know the name of his. Oops. The skills. Wrong button. That's the right button. Whee! No, it does not seem like a very hard game. Ooh, look at that. There's a gem. I'm going to push it. I'm not quite sure why that. Oh, does that mean that I have to go around the other way to access things? I think it does. You want to kill me so badly, don't you, bad guy? But you can't get to me, huh? Huh? Whee! Okay, yeah. I better put all of these ghostly spirits to rest, huh? Can I do that? Can it be done? Not this way. That's a lot of dread refs. That's a lot of dread refs. Also, I forgot to heal my party. I should probably use special moves. Oh no, I got fouled! Almost my whole party got fouled. Do I have any anti fouls? No. Okay, well.
Richard Fowl Taha. No effect, yeah. Bam. Cured foul. Okay, well, that did some damage. Oh no! You got put in a blender! Why are they blenders anyway? Why is that a thing? Why is that happening in this game? Guys, I don't understand the logic of this game. It is quite a strange experience. Bam! Oops. Man, he is really good. Uh... Oh, that's not what I meant to do. I thought there was a finisher. Yes, I aspired to level five! Muscle Zobber. Yes. <laughs> Are you serious? Game, has anyone ever told you that you're goofy? Because you're goofy. You are super goofy. Ah. Is this going to go somewhere? Nope. Well, that's okay. I just think I wasted all of that stuff. But that's okay. Wait, didn't I get new gear? Did I equip it? Hey, Doc. Did I do that? Hmm, I did this wrong. Well, equip with. I need to get you new clothes, don't I, buddy? All right, we're gonna go get you some new clothes, buddy. Hold on. Oh, man, and then we're gonna save, and we're gonna give a dog a bone. Bye. Why would you ever get that one and not this one? No, you do need brain. All right, friends. I have a full party, though. All right, let's go see what happens if we give a dog a bone. If he'll give us the best shoes ever. Oh my god, it's got out of character! In parentheses! damage, but my speed is way up. Okay, cool. I'll take it. Does that mean that somebody else can equip my wrist brace? Okay, well that happened. I suppose I should go stay at the inn and then I should buy m Hi, Leaf. Okay, well, I'm gonna buy bee ball juice. Oh 
my god, look at Ella. She's such a cutie. She's such a cutie. This doesn't have protein paste. Okay, well. I guess I don't need... So once upon a time, when I was a kid, but not as young as you would expect me to be based on this story, my aunt, well, so my mom, there's a swimming pool at my mom's house, and um, a bunch of us went swimming while my aunt and cousins were in town when I was a kid, and my aunt put on uh, one of those like cap thingies that keeps your head wet or dry when you go swimming. I don't know what those are called, bathing caps? Anyway, she decided that she was not a shark. And she would chase us around. And be like, oh, it's not a shark. And we'd all be like, oh no! It was. I don't know why I'm telling you this. I think a swimming cap sounds about right. Oh, what? You won't let me go the wrong way, will you, buddy? Okay. To be fair, if you let me go the wrong way, I will never go the right way. As Undertale people learned the hard way. Oh man! They're gonna have kidnapped my son, it's gonna be terrible. Yes, yeah, she was not a shark. That's exactly right, Propagable. Is this the church? No, this is not the church. I'm sorry, Barkley. I just, I don't know how to use controls. Ah, here we go. All right. Oh no! That dude is dead. Oh no! Oh no, you're not gonna kill my kid. The thing is, like, he's like this, like, horribly not a nice guy. My goodness. This is some heavy stuff going on. Was there a bird Jordan rivalry? Is this, is this a funny choice of people to be in this situation? I didn't KS Dunk Manhattan. No, the dead guy is. The dead guy is crumpty. Oh dear. Uh oh. He's the chosen one. We're gonna have some sort of Xenogears level of, of, I don't even know. I like how V in Vince Bork doesn't get capitalized the second time around. Are any of them not jerks in real life? Let me know if they're not. Like, is Vince Borg actually nice in real life? Oh no! No, Vince Borg, no! Jackson for Michael Jordan. 
that what's happening? Is that Moonwalker? What is happening here? Why did they do I mean, it's very clearly intentionally meant to be funny. It is, but I'm also just like, you see, not Oh my god! Oh my god, he's shooting me with his foot! He has a gun in his foot! Because... Oh my god. Wait, is this seriously the guy from Deep Purple who's saying this? Like... What is the what is the deal with that, Chrono? Please tell me about this. Let me know what is happening. Okay, that's what I thought, Sims Magic. <laughs> Not untrue. But how did... Is this... Is this an original composition for this game? No, but this isn't a JRPG for the Xbox. This is a fan edit. Did they take this song from something else? I'm so confused. Okay, it's stolen. Okay, that makes so much more sense. Did you guys know that Blind Guardian did all the music for this absolutely horrible RPG series called Sacred? Okay. Well, I'm glad to know I'm gonna have to blast your brain, I'm sorry, buddy. Blind Guardian is great, it's true. I like Blind Guardian a lot. But it's just kind of an awkward thing. Ha! Don't look, you're the one who just shot the priest dude and then threatened to kill a kid. I don't think you get to call me a bad person. You'll bleed Gatorade to your graves. No, Vinceborg, no! No! Betrayal! Betrayal! And tragedy. Blind Guardian has like a 12 minute long song about the fall of Troy. Which is my favorite. It's called And Then There Was Silence and it's super good. Uh oh, is this gonna be. Oh, I guess this must be the dying guy being tragic. Oh no! Oh my god, they put they put some like red splatters on his portrait. 
really badly. Look at that. This is so sad. Oh no! Because it was me. Oh no, tragedy! The second in Setsu 3 the angel statue looked out over all of us. Ah, and then we came back down through the sewers into the cyber dwarf's basement because that's the sort of sentence that makes lots of sense. I think that's as short as RPGs go. Alright. That's right, people were talking about the ultimate b-ball, having the power. Oh no, hoops! You're gonna have to save us! Oh, the space gem! <laughs> a century but oh no no but <gasps> guys <laughs> no this no, I can't! His great-grandfather! His great-grandfather was killed before the purge. <sighs> no, it's... It's just... <laughs> no, but no! No, it doesn't make any sense! I can't handle it! Why did they do that? I mean, I mean... To be fair, stories have terrible chronology, but... Twelve years ago, his great-grandfather died. It was my character's friend, but my character's also friends with him. But my character has a son who is, like, as old as... No. I... No. Guys. I... I guess we'll just we'll just blame the chaos dunk. James Legacy. Last to heart. <laughs> ah, oh now we got the snail one, so that's convenient. that Cyber Dwarf is made of basketballs and like everything else in this game. Oh man. No, this game is amazing. Like through and through, like it's not just like it's like a like a little one-off joke thing. Like there are jokes throughout and sometimes they fail to land, but um it's so absurd. Forge a new ultimate people, of course we are. Are we gonna have to like go like get the like mystical things from around the world like the the I don't even know what components go into a basketball and I guess maybe the people who made this game do oh my god yes we're gonna go get the component parts to make an ultimate basketball <laughs> Proto Neo <laughs> Proto, you got just in time! Look! This section of the game is named after you! I know Spalding is the main basketball manufacturer because they said something to that effect earlier. Uh-oh, 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 Barkley is being all mysterious!
Why are you- No, why is that an acronym now, Cyberdwarf? That's not an acronym! No! Good night, Doc! Okay. Hoops has joined the party! Hoops! Hoops! No! Baby! Child! No! I should have a lot of jerseys. Gear, huh? Coat, threads, threads. No, his guns don't have an apostrophe. Cyber Dwarf does text gear, see? Yeah, no, Tales of Games makes me very happy with that. Oh, okay, there's a couple of them, but not his weapons class. Status shot, huh? Okay. Alright, reveal plot to me. They're serious customers. Hi, Hoops. It's nine o'clock and I don't usually end until ten, but Oh my god, Sims, are you telling me that Undertale has a reference to this game? I'm sorry, Paraguay, you did. It had really epic music. Yeah, no, Vinceborg was programmed to be bad, but we're gonna get him back and he's gonna be a good guy in the end. He'll probably sacrifice himself saving us. It is 9 o'clock, right? 9.15, my time. Oh, well, I'm really glad to know that Toby Fox referenced this game. That is excellent. <laughs> oh, Balthius, tell us how you really feel. Yes! He will remember who he is. There's good in him still, I'm sure of it. Good. I know he's gotta finish helping with the, uh, the uh, Homestuck game, but then hopefully he'll make more games for us. There's going to be some pressure, and people are going to be weird. Oh my god. I would play that Paraguay. Yeah, well, I think, I think it'll be good for him to make something else, and whether it fails or is okay, like, once he's made a second thing, it'll be alright. Um... You need power. Yeah, I, 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 I think he'll probably. Yeah, I, I would want his second game to be standalone, and then he can make more things that are not Undertale. And then if he wants to make something else that has to do with Undertale, like... Oh my gosh. 
Hello, turkey friends. I mean, yeah. Oh my god, Barkley, don't say something horrible. If you do say something really mean, Balthios should call you out on it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I love how I feel like the two of them are like having two completely different conversations. guys. This music is really good, guys. I don't even know what direction these little guys are facing. The whistles are really bad, actually. Let's fight the whistle. Oh my god! Where did they get his sprite from, guys? He's, like, literally the most 90s thing I have ever seen in my entire life. He has a backwards baseball cap and rollerblades. Like, guys. Guys. You don't seem to appreciate that. Wow, that child. All right, well, he definitely looks like the chosen one to me. I probably should have stayed at the end. Oh well. Accurate shot. Rapid fire. Mega shot. I'm bad at that. bit good, wasn't he, Vince? No, they wanted to not have more animation frames, like, otherwise he wouldn't fit. Okay, got it. Huh. All right. That didn't hit at all. Oh, no, it did. Okay. Oh, I can change topics. Okay. Mm, I see. Okay, it's an English joke. Got it. Bam! I hit it so much more damage. There's actually good to have him hit the bad guy that's farther from him because there's more distance for the snail to grow. I did say that. I did. I said that. You heard those words that I said. Okay. Hey, 
see Sirius Inc? No, you did not. Bam! I keep hitting the wrong keys. Oh my god! He's like doing like a cool kid kick thing. Hey Sphere, yeah, no, I I recruited I recruited a dwarf whose skin is basketballs. Oh, this looks like this is gonna be a, a plot info dump. Rufus. Yes! We have a dwarf with with basketball skin and a small child who shoots guns. Uh-oh! Cyber Dwarf is being mysterious now! We're gonna have to fight some sort of a rat infestation from the sounds of it. Oh, I probably should have stayed at the end. Oh well. That's what gear is for, right? I mean, I suppose I can just go back and stay at the end. And then I'll just have to, like, fight, like, that thing again. Right? Let's go do that. It's not that far. I think. Or did I do it wrong? Am I coming? Oh. Everything is so dramatically written. You know? Alright, where's the end? There's an end. Here's the end. Hi, friends! Whee! I know. I fit the, uh... Hi, buddy! Oh no, and I don't have... You are a fast kid. I did it wrong. Well, that's okay. I'm learning how to use this. Bam! Oh no! Oh my god. I have to say, I appreciate Alright. Okay. I guess I need to get the rhythm of that, right? Oh, nice! Okay, that's nice. So it's not timed. Oh my god, that thing's spinning. I'm glad to know that you guys were able to tell me exactly who Hoops is because, like, his sprite is. Bam! Yeah, I think Rapid Shot is what I'm gonna have to use against those little guys. Oh, hey, look, there's a dude! That sprite looks familiar. Oh geez, speaking of. Alright, that is perfect. That is perfect. Did that right? Yes. So good. Is a multi-hit, does he? I can just never hit with it though. See, that's why I don't do it. Yeah, like it is really kind of strange that Hoops doesn't. Like he uses guns. Right, we're gonna get a thing. Face mask. 
That sounds like something you would wear. Oh no, it lowers brain. Hmm. Oh man, that raises guard a lot. Bought hoops. Did I buy hoops a new gun? I don't remember. Oh, but there's a save spot right there. Let's see. Haha! -ha! I ambushed you. Oh my goodness, there's a lot of you guys. Okay. Let's try that again, shall we? Nope. I'm not terribly good at the mini game things of some of these characters, but I still appreciate this again. Oh, okay. You just want to hit it before that. Okay, got it. That is not cool. It's really weird. Why is... No! My whole party had a stroke! Uh, well... Stroke got cured. That's good to know. Yes! Okay, that's actually really good. We'll be doing that more from now on. Oh man, the victory animations are so special. Hi! It's time to slam jam! Welcome to the space jam. No, I missed it. That was bad, Lauren. Not good. Yes, it's pitched up and sped up, too. Oh, no, I didn't get it in time. All right, so let's try this again. Crunched me, you munched me, I got hurt. The numbers look like they're really big, but then like I look at my health bar and I'm like, oh actually that's not so bad at all. Okay. Alright, there goes you. There's probably something better to do with the timing there, but I'm not doing it. All right, and then you. Yes! Okay. Cool. Roller blades. Just like... I mean, that seriously is the most... Yeah, no, it's not nearly as... Um, as broken as one might expect. The locations loop a lot, which is 
is a uh, nice of them, I think. That's is that where I wanna go? Oh hello person. This looks like this is the building. writing just fanfic. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Interesting slash dapper fighting stuff. Zazzy? I don't think... No, that... Okay, what is the second Z in me? That's bad. Oh my god, are you gonna make fun of the name of his swords? By the way, they're named Twinkle and Icing Death. The Structural Goblins and Over Racism. Obvious. Oh no. Ewing, is that a funny joke? Guys, I don't know who these people are, but... Looks like where I'm supposed to go, so we're gonna go the other way. Thank you guys for translating all the basketball for me. He's in Space Jam. We clearly, we need to watch Space Jam again, friends. Hi, person. Did I do that? Haha! Alright. Cause I mean that's not a basketball player, that's a mythological figure. Oh my 
god. Oh my god. Why is dungeon spelled that way? Okay, I'm not gonna lie, most of what I listen to is video game music. Oh man. Well, okay, so Proto, I wondered about that too. I wondered as a as a as an English speaker when you talk to Japanese people that like you hold in regard. Do you use Japanese honorifics? And the answer is yes. So if I talk about my experience performing on stage at MAGFest with the composer of Panda Dragon Saga, um, I talk about that I, that I performed with uh, Kobayashi-san. That's what you do. So now I know. I had to kind of follow example the example of the translator, who's like a professional translator, so I figured she knew what she was doing there. So. Yeah, Chrono Cross is not a good game as far as I can tell, but it has good music. One of the best. There's a video of me at, um, I think it was Orlando Nerdfest, or maybe Nerdpalooza, um, but they, were, they had a jam space like side stage, and Random Encounter had asked me if I was going to play with them like for like this like fun side show, and I was like, no, nah, it's fine. But I have my flute with me, because I always carry my flute with me at events like this. Anyway, they start playing Time Scar. And... I open up, uh, I, I'm like, I can't do this. I can't not play my flute. So I put together my, uh, I, like, I put my flute together to start playing in the audience. And they're like, come on, get on stage with us. So I'm, like, playing Time Scar, like, walking onto the stage. <laughs> so I have a problem. That problem is that I can't not play Time Scar. It's one of the best songs. Um. Aha, I can buy more protein paste. Good. All that's useful to have. What does this one do again? Oh wow! I mean, this is really expensive, but ha! I don't have enough science points still. Is this where I'm supposed to go? Then I guess I'll go back down to the other place. Oh man. Yes! Michelle Heafy and String Player Gamer did collaborate on that song. I've been trying to get her to do a cover of um, Bermisia's music from Final Fantasy IX because she's really busy. So that didn't happen. collaboration with him too but um, I never did record my part and that was like two years ago so we've moved on it'll happen eventually probably a different track but still I'm gonna tell him you said that he'll be glad to know <laughs> he's a nice guy too if you ever get the chance sometimes he made it up to MAGFest last year, um, but it's a bit far since he's traveling internationally, so he wasn't able to go this year. But maybe next year. Oh! Alright, I will! <laughs> That's a lot of money. Klaus? Alright. No, Chrono, you just 
I've been in the VGM scene in one form or another since 2010, and I talk to everybody. So, I am in a band, so I know all of the bands. I'm on YouTube, so I know a number of the YouTubers, but I didn't actually get to know the YouTubers until I got to know the Super Yotar Bros through the band scene. But they're, oh, they were also YouTubers. So because I knew them, then the other YouTubers were like, hey, you're friends with our friends. So then I got to know the YouTubers. But then I joined the Materia Collective um, and actually have been extremely involved with that, like, in, on a number of different levels. And so, like, I know everybody through that. And so, like, across all of these things, I know most of them. So it's pretty cool. So I don't ever mean to be, like, <laughs> I don't ever mean to be, like, name dropping. <laughs> Because I sometimes forget that my friends are famous. <laughs> oh man. Okay, Proto, who did that? Because that's adorable. So I didn't know Overclocked Remix um, people much, but I now have a friend who I've done some remixes with, and then my friend Doug Drum Ultima has apparently been an Overclocked Remixer for a long time. Um, and as I've kind of gotten to know a few more of them, and eventually I'll know that scene too. <laughs> oh man, I'm really delighted about that. God, who is trollish enough to do that who is in that scene that I know of? Norg? Well, but the thing is, Propagable is that, like, to me, they're just, like, dorky, awkward nerds. And I'm like, we like, I like to go hear my band, my friend's band play, and people are like, oh my god, did you know that so and so is performing? And I'm like, oh my god, right? People get excited about them. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's this is not a humble brag. It's just I, I'm trying to say like, if I start talking casually about people, like it, the face cam is desync for my audio. Oh, I'm sorry about that. I don't know. Anyway, the VGM scene is not that big, and you get to know everybody. After long enough, Nox is trying to tell me that she thinks I should shut down soon. Well, unfortunately, there's not much I can do at this point, but, um... Uh... Cat cam goes off. Yeah, I know, Nox... But Nox is gonna go eat and then be mad that I'm still playing. I'm sorry, Nox. No, so they've had to stop eating wet food because of Nox's kidney problems, so now I give them dry food. <laughs> um. Oh my god, okay, Proto, that is long before I knew anyone involved with this remix or any of this stuff. That was before I graduated high school. That's really kind of delightful, actually, and I'm really, really curious who it is if I know any of them, but I'm really delighted that that happens. It's nice to know that we're all dorks. Yeah, no, OC Remix is old enough that I listened to it when I was in high school. Which is why it's really funny that I now know some of those people personally. Oh, man. Yeah, no, it's never what, what time. Well, okay, no, I actually did give them a little bit of wet food yesterday because I have to give Knox. I'm sorry for anybody who's watching for, like, games to get played here because we're just kind of rambling. But I have to give Nox subcutaneous fluids, and so I gave her a little wet food yesterday to like make her happier about that. And also because Ella's been losing some weight eating the dry food, so I figured I'd give her some of that. So it's a it's a thing. Eleven. Oh, okay, Proto. That is even better. Hyperborea, Hyperborea, no legends. Okay, I'm not actually sure exactly which game they're referencing here. Oh my God! Oh my god! Hoops, are you gonna nerd out with this nerd? No! Let your son be a nerd! No! Barkley! Barkley! Oh my god, okay. I actually know a couple of those folks, but not most of them. But I actually might have guessed that Sean would be involved. That's funny. 
But they must have all been baby children back then. Oh my god, though, that's like... 15, 16 years ago? That's so great. Seafield, Geldrock, and the Fair Plains. Far Plains. You are a unique looking individual. I can't. Okay, here we go. <laughs> oh my god. to a plastic surgeon instead of an ER. Just saying. This is a really interesting situation. Oh, that hit close to home. This sprite, I've seen this one before. Who are you? good. Just keep trying, no? No? Okay, well. Yes, we don't have the money to do this. We don't have that. Oh my god, we're just gonna beat everyone up, Barkley? <laughs> All right. Ah, hoops. Cyber dwarf, something is wrong with you. I'm like trying to picture what he would look like with skin that isn't basketball. Wait, are they seriously giving me like branching choices? Did I save? Yes, I did. Wow! Branching choices! Well, it's time for me to shut down, so I'll have to make my decision next time. 
crazy. I wonder if there's like a better reward or worse reward. I would try to beat up the bad guy, but I'm afraid that if I beat him up, I won't be able. These people won't be able to have the surgery that they want to be happy. So, but he's also an extortionist who lies to them about how much it's going to cost. So, but yes, I have a full week to think it over. Thank you guys for joining me. I know these are kind of weird streams, um, but I hope that you've been having a good time. And we'll be doing Night in the Woods after this. So yeah, and then, oh, so Thursday is Dark Souls. Friday, we're gonna be doing, listening to one of the albums of Spira, Final Fantasy X arranged by the Materia Collective, and I will be doing some Final Fantasy X fan art. So, if you're into that sort of thing, we'll be doing that Friday night. So watch this space. All right. Bye, guys. Thank you for joining. It was awesome to have you here. Good night.